Theories of the Passivity Passivation is the process of treating or coating a metal in order to reduce the chemical reactivity of its surface. In stainless steel, passivation means removing the free iron from the surface of the metal using an acid solution to prevent rust. On the basis of the passive film nature, two theories are there to explain the phenomena of metal or alloys passivation. They are as follows. Oxide Film Formation Theory of Passivation This theory states that the passive film is always a diffusion barrier layer of the reaction products of metal or alloy oxides, hydroxides, oxyhydroxides, or other compounds that separate metal or alloy from its environment and which slows down the corrosion rate of a metal or alloy. According to this theory, the diffusion barrier film's ability to protect the metal or alloy depends on the degree of restraint it imposes on the dissolution of the metal or alloy when the film is established. This process is followed by three processes in the presence of the electric field as the entry of metal atoms into the metal film interface, transport of metal or oxygen ion through the oxide, dissolution of metal ion from the film at the film environment interface. These processes are driven by the electric field across the film and so the following properties are required for the protective passive films according to the oxide film formation theory. Stability over a wide potential range. Mechanical integrity and low ionic conductivity. Good electron conductivity to reduce the potential difference across the film. Low solubility and slow down dissolution rate in the prevailing aqueous medium. Adsorption theory of the passivation. According to this theory of passivity, metallic substances are generally passivated by a chemisorbed of oxygen. The chemisorbed film displaces the normally adsorbed water molecules and slows down the rate of dissolution of substances involving hydration of metal ions. Adsorbed oxygen decreases the equilibrium exchange current density or increases the anodic over the potential of a reaction of metal as mentioned here. A passivating effect is clearly observed even in less than a monolayer of chemisorbed film. Such a monolayer chemisorbed film does not act primarily as a diffusion barrier layer. Hence, a diffusion barrier film formation is not a necessary condition to observe the passivity of metallic substances according to this theory. The adsorbed oxygen film forms preferentially on the transition metals in accord with their uncoupled d electrons interacting with oxygen to form a stable bond. Because transition metals have generally high heat of sublimation compared to non-transition metals. Due to the high heat of sublimation, transition metals favor the absorption of environment oxygen to obtain the chemisorbed passive film on the surface of metals or alloys. In conclusion, the mechanism of the passivity of the metallic substances is not only the formation of a diffusion barrier film, but rather one of the retarded reaction rates of adsorbed oxygen layer according to this adsorption theory of passivity. Thanks for watching, bye bye, see you.